Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play The Sims 4 and Duplex Life. We're going to go to see the birth of this child that might be born. <laughs> and I'm pretty excited because this is the first time we actually have a baby in the house. Um, of course with Victoria we do have a child but no babies. It's really interesting to see how things go with a baby in the building and still keeping them apart because I know Victoria, she's definitely going to want to go over to Trudy's house and take care of her baby <laughs> when she's not there or even, even if she is there, the baby's crying or something. And as you know from The Sims, babies cry really loud in this game. It's so realistic. I'm trying to get her to actually go to the bloody hospital and with the, the right person. It'd be so weird um, to have Victoria with us when goes to the hospital. Okay, I do have to apologise for a slight mishap with the f um, editing. For some reason, all the footage that was taken at the hospital is completely gone. Literally all of it. All of us as editing all of a sudden. All I got is coming back from the hospital in no footage from actually at the hospital. Completely got it. Don't know where the footage got to, but it's nowhere on my computer. So <laughs> you've missed the entire birth, which is heartbreaking. I'm so sad that you don't get to actually see the birth of the baby. But it's pretty, you know, standard hospital. The mom goes in, has things coming out of her body, and then baby. And then we go home. It was a quick birth, it was painless, I'd say, but yeah, it sucks that you, didn't, you don't get to actually see it because of a stupid computer. <laughs> but okay, we're on our way home now, you can see us going home in with baby and see Trudy in her nightgown. <laughs> And we're just about getting home now, I think. Load. Load. Yes? You want to load? No, you got to load. Okay. You don't want to load. Okay, here we are. We're home! Yay! <laughs> it's going away now. Yes? Okay. <laughs> uh, we've made it home. Where's the baby? <laughs> the first question is where's the baby? Mm. Mm hmm. Yes, please show me baby. Where's my baby? We're home and they just want to talk to each other and I want to see my baby. Look at them, like we just gave birth and having kissy kissy. I am not doing that. <laughs> Thank you. I just want to see my baby. <laughs> That's all I care about right now. And of course, the baby miraculously is in Victoria's house. And just like I told you, Victoria is looking after my baby. <laughs> She shouldn't be looking after Trini's baby. I keep saying my baby. <laughs> I don't know why I'm saying my baby, but anyway, she shouldn't be taking care of Trini's baby. <laughs> Unless she's like invited her over to babysit or something. So right now I'm just putting something, you know, putting something. Putting the crib in our room, in Trudy and Edson's room. So yeah, I don't know. I think I should put something in there to up the baby decor because right now it's just looks like a vampire's bedroom it's so red and black and not other colors so i think it'd be really nice to have some cute baby things in the room not just adult boring things there's actually nothing really nice in my bedroom i'm never really in there i mean i'm, I'm talking like I'm, it's me <laughs> trudy is is rarely in that room so yeah, we don't have anything like really nice in there, except for the trophy case which you see there. But yeah, I want to put some nice photos and really spruce the place up for the baby. Hmm? It's not going to be a baby for like three days then it's going to be a child, which would be really really fun to see, a child with Vivi. But I'm thinking by the time this child is um a child, I mean, okay, yeah, reverse. I think by the time that this child, this baby is a child, Vivi will be a teenager. <laughs> There's a possibility of that, but we'll see how how things actually progress. 
Um, I don't know if I can put anything else in there, but I want to sell some stuff because we need money, I think, badly. We're going to be pretty low on funds soon. So I want to sell a few of these useless things we don't use. Okay, bye bye to that. I don't think I'm going to sell anything else though. I might, but one of those belongs to Victoria and one belongs to Trudy, so I'm just going to keep them in there. Okay, back to life. Okay, let's go and take care of my baby. Where's my baby? How's my baby doing? How are you doing, little baby? <laughs> As you can tell, I'm kind of baby obsessed right now, but my sims seem to just want to talk to each other. <laughs> but let's get out of this dressing gown. That, 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 that will be a start. Get Trudy out of the dressing gown, and then we can focus on the baby. I've got a text message. Somebody wants to do something. I'm sorry. I just had a baby. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> yeah. Thanks, anyway. Okay. Edison, you need to do something. Okay, baby. You think you're a baby too? Good, good, good. And who are you? <laughs> oh, that's him. Ah, I wanted him to get to know Victoria. A little flirt flirty. Uh huh. Since now that the baby's born, we can kind of focus a little bit more on Victoria. Just a little, because they've been so Trudy at sis for the past, I don't know, four or five episodes. It's been all about Trudy and not much about Victoria. And we haven't been to the store in ages. So, yeah, I do want to f try to focus a bit more on Victoria and get her married. But the babies kind of take up a lot of our time as well, because once the baby starts crying... You do not want to hear it. It's literally like an actual baby. It just cries and cries and cries. And if you don't have the volume up pretty high, you might not even hear the baby crying. <laughs> so or you, you'll just see like the... What, what, it's green now, but you might see it a different colour. It might... It, when it's, it's... When the baby is sleeping, it turns grey. But when the baby is actually like upset... It will be like a bluish colour, but it looks kind of grey and I can't determine the two colours that well because I'm blind-ish. But um, I just have to hover over it and make sure baby's sleeping and not crying. Because <laughs> the colours look, look too similar. I already think we should change the crying colours. Anyway, so let's just try to chat up um, Blaine over here because... I think these two will really get on. They both like outdoors. I literally created this sim just for Victoria. <laughs> I, I literally created him for Victoria. I, I made a guy who was like perfect for her. But if they actually, I don't know if they actually hit it off. Because the last time I took Victoria on a date, it did not end so well. She ended up with some complete freaking weirdo who treated her like crap on a date. And I didn't even say the footage, it was, it was completely horrible. So, <laughs> hopefully this one actually goes a lot there. We'll see what happens. So far, it looks okay, but I need to make sure the doors are properly locked and unlocked. Because I don't want Victoria in that house with my baby. <laughs> so, yeah, that that's the hardest thing because I I, un I unlocked it earlier because we were having a gathering or something. So yeah, I need to make sure it's locked again, so we don't have random people come in my house. I do not want that guy in my house as well. Blaine, I don't know him. I I do know him, but um, Edison doesn't know him. So I think it'd be really awkward to have a man in my house. <laughs> my husband doesn't know. Keep saying my <laughs> Trudy's husband. I I gotta I gotta stop saying my. I, I just picture myself as Trudy, because we have so much in common. Anyway, back to the couple. How are my lovely couple getting on? <laughs> I'm looking at self on photos. Look at Vivi over there, just having fun. Loving life, yeah, good girl. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's nice. Oh yeah, let's do this. Okay, let's have her do this. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So enthusiastic. <laughs> like, really enthusiastic. It's, is it getting late? It's, I mean, it's a bit late, so we can't stay that long. I'm pretty. Bibi has to go to sleep. 
Okay, you see the colour there on the on the baby? The colour right now is grey, so that means the baby is asleep. So hopefully no mishaps. Yes. You will see what happens. <laughs> baby mishaps. If that turns blue, then we're in trouble. Right now it's grey, so I need babies to sleep so we can keep flirting with Blaine over here. Okay, let's see what else can we do. We've been standing out here for a while. Oh, we're flicking, we're getting flirty. And Vivi is very playful. She looks really smart in that suit, doesn't she? Go on, Trudy. Mm, and of course, she's in, she's like. I'm not, you know, in, in the mood, no. Baby's been born, baby's asleep. Time for us to flee. We've only been married, like, three days. <laughs> oh, they're stargazing. Good, 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 good. That's not such a dear remedy to stargaze. Yeah. I've, I've, have you ever actually been stargazing, like, in real life with anybody? If you have, do comment below. I think it's really interesting. I've never actually done it before. Not with another person. I've... Look at the stars with like my brother or something. Back when I, I lived in a place where there was no really po light pollution, so you could see all the stars or a good amount of them anyway. But um, I've never been actually stargazing with a partner or anything like that. But if you have, do comment below and if you enjoyed it or if it's really boring. But like, make constellations and stuff. And how are you doing, Edison? I want. Trudy to practice her writing, so you need, you need to go off the computer. Sorry, I want you off the computer. I'm really horrible. <laughs> There's my baby over there practicing her violin. She is so studious. I have the most genius daughter. Well, Victoria does anyway. My girl is a complete musical genius. And I guess she's an everything genius. She's just good at everything, honestly. Oh, I forgot this person was here now. <laughs> I completely forgot. Is that blue or grey? I'm so scared of it changing colour all of a sudden and you're not noticing. Right, let's check on the couple. How are they doing down there? I think they're doing okay. Mm, it's going up a bit. They're not friends yet. Are they? They're kind of, I mean, they're, they're love birds, but they're not, their friendship is not that high. She, she's got a higher friendship level with Ezra, but it's just, Ezra's like seeing like three other girls at the moment, so <laughs> I don't know if I want her dating a playboy like Ezra. <laughs> he's just too good looking. He's like, he's good with all the girls. Okay. Oh, it's full. Okay. Let's continue what we're doing. Okay, Trudy, I want you to continue what you're doing. That's it's still grey. Baby's still asleep. No crying babies. Don't want any of that. <laughs> Edson, how you doing? You know me, right? Uh, it's, you're nearly done. Okay. And he's leaving, okay. Say goodbye to your little friend then. Oh, she's hungry. Please get something to eat. Oh, baby's awake. Victoria, you're having fun. Trudy, you're doing what you're doing. Edison. Working out. Hey, bef before I had the machines in here, I just had, not all machines, I just had the, the treadmill. He was only doing cardio, he wasn't actually doing any um, muscle definition workouts, so I, ha I had to buy that so he could actually get some muscle, otherwise he'd just be getting fit as opposed to getting bulky, you know, beefing up. And to encourage that even more, we eat some food. <laughs> but he's not that hungry, so just gonna have to eat some cereal or something. And then sort himself out. Yes? Mm -hmm. Okay. And then you can sit because I kind of want them to have a little moment together. Oh, but the baby needs us. So, no sleep for you, sorry. Must check on the baby. Writing is complete, so you can stop now. And take care of the baby. Baby's more important. Baby is much more important. Any of those good enough to pen? This one is. Okay, I'll pen that one. Okay, what else? How, they, how are you guys doing out here? Blame. I want to romance you. 
because our romant romant romance <laughs> bar is pretty low. But our friendship bar is good, getting higher. That's good. I think we're just about the same amount as she's with Ezra. So just get that bit higher and work on the romance. Yes. How you doing? She's doing okay. Her highest skill is still that one. Which is really good, but we need her writing to be up there as well. Number ten. Mm-hmm. And look at my genius daughter. Look at this. Look at this girl. She's freaking amazing. I love this little girl. It's my little genius. I didn't even give her the genius trait. It just made her outgoing. But she's rose, risen to the occasion and just become juggernaut. Oops, something's wrong. Why is she sat there alone? Where's playing? He can't come in. <laughs> Doors are locked. Sorry, Blaine. You can come in now. Sorry about that. You'll be alright, won't you? Yeah? Okay. Baby is still green, so no crying babies. And uh, he's turning green. My baby is still pink. What is you take one kisses to her or something. <laughs> okay. She's like, oh, come in. Let's have some fun. I still need to fix that fix in the computer. Look at it. Electrocute my daughter or something. I've already set my daughter on fire, if you remember. That was really bad. Oh, she shouldn't be cleaning. No, she's got that, that, that bad midlet of the worms. She's squeamish. I, I, I don't want her cleaning. He should always do the cleaning cleaning up because she gets really squeamish when she touches dirty things. She's literally me. <laughs> I, I don't like cleaning dirty dishes either. <laughs> so I, I usually buy lots of disposable things. So I just have to toss them when I'm done and don't have to clean them. <laughs> because I hate touching dirty things. Okay, let's socialise and complain about problems. No, not doing that. That's not really romantic. Yes, let's do that. Where, 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 where is he going? Where, where are you going? Why are you in there? Oh, it is sin. Really, really. I unlocked the door for Blaine. You know, the two of them are out the door. She's. It looks like she's going into Trudy's house. For some reason, Edison is in there. Edison, leave. <laughs> I know it's just being. Uh, this game honestly sometimes. I I need to tweak tweak some things. I'm gonna actually add a fence around the house so that this doesn't happen anymore. I think I think that's the best thing to do is to add a fence because I, I'm tired of this happening. Yeah, I th with the fence we could prevent them from even getting into the doorway as opposed to just the door. So they can't even get into the doorway if we put a fence there. Let's move some things around. Yeah, so it's exactly half of the house. Make it exactly perfect. Yeah, because, yeah, I'm really in it about things being symmetrical. <laughs> okay, we need another one of these on her side. Do we? I don't know. I don't like any of these, <laughs> to tell the truth. I think the previous smell boxes have been much nicer. But when The Sims 4 finally actually does a proper apartment life um, expansion pack, then we can get the really nice smell boxes that cater to more than one family. Those will be really nice. I don't, I don't know if I like this door. No, I don't like anything. I don't like anything. We'll see. I'm, I'm, I'll keep, I might keep it, but... Anyway, uh, let's get on with the building. Uh, no, not doing that. <laughs> that will be expensive. One, and horrible. Two. <laughs> Erase. Okay. Let's try this again. The actual thing and not that thing. Yay, it's done it right this time. That wasn't fun before. <laughs> okay. Now we can see better the sphere and... No, that, that, it, that's in the way. Sorry about that. Okay, anyway, continue. Um, oh, wait, but that, that thing was in the way. Oh, yeah. uh, um, how are we going to do this? Uh, mm, okay, 
from around it a little without deleting it and without making that stupid thing again. Oi. <laughs> I'm just going to keep doing this, I think. Because that's just what I do. I, I, oi. Headache. <laughs> I have no headache from doing this already. And the mailbox is in a way again. <laughs> headache. It, it's fun though. It's a fun headache. It's just... Okay. No, wait, uh, I'm doing this kind of funny, aren't I? Okay, let's just put this out there and then try to extend the fence to the way I actually wanted to go. I think just right there is okay. There! I'm do <laughs> Oi! It's so hard to, to remember that if I start it from the wall, it does that. If I don't start it from the wall, it, it goes the way it's supposed to do. Get rid of this one in the middle because we don't need it. Say goodbye, and I like it. I like it like that. Hers has to be slightly bigger because she's got the garden. This way, that this will keep the kids who come around for Vivi out of the garden. You know, I was just thinking. Um, Vivi has her own little club there. You know, her with her mates. It'd be really interesting if my my son, our Trudy's son, makes his own group. And they're kind of rivals of Vivi's group. That would be so cool. But it depends on how much longer Vivi's going to be a child. For I don't remember. I, I put it on the long. It's on longer. So she should be a child for quite some time. But we'll see. Mm, fences. Fences, fences, fences. Which fence do I actually like? Mm, no. No. It's not It's not exactly centred. I'm I, 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 I need want something that's going to be centered and the right color. <gasps> I love it. That's gorgeous. And put one there. It's perfect. Yay! And now we can actually play again. <laughs> okay, so I need to lock the door, but we need to not be there first. I mean, Victoria and Blaine need to leave <laughs> my front porch, what tree's front porch, and go back on their side. <laughs> But look at the fence, it looks really nice though. I'm happy ha with how it turned out. Ooh, I want to do this. Baby is still green, so we're, we're, we're okay for now. And baby is asleep. Not that it matters because we're in a different house. <gasps> Victoria, get out of my house. Victoria, what are you doing? Why are you awkward? <gasps> what happened? What happened with, 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 with you and Blaine? Oh no, something happened. Something went wrong. Why are you getting food? <laughs> out of her kitchen. Oi. I was did, did, you, did, you saw me lock the door. How did Victoria get in there? That's what I want to know. Look at this. Look at these two. Oh God. <gasps> it's blue. It's blue. The baby's crying. Oh no. Use a diaper change. Well, they're, well, they're, they're doing stuff. I can't stop them in the middle of it. Oh, this one's actually me cry for a bit. You can't hear it there, thank goodness. I have the volume really low, so you can actually hear the baby crying. It's not a nice sound, believe me. You don't want to hear that. Loud baby. Now let's sort out this door, because this is freaking annoying me. <laughs> anyway, okay. It needs to be locked to the right people and not to the wrong people. And put it. See, that that's the challenge of the duplex life, is keeping them apart. <laughs> keeping people in their own bloody apartments. Like duplexes to be certain. The baby's still crying. Yeah, that's are taking a long time. I should be impressed, but I'm just annoyed because I want you to stop and take care of the baby. <laughs> Let's speed this up. <laughs> I'm just all flirty and got some weird hanger saying, "Oh, oh, okay." He got a nice little moodlet there, but baby is more important than what you guys are doing. <laughs> Anyway, Victoria, oh, but poor Victoria, she's feeling really cross uh, from filthy things in the apartment. I'm guessing it's that juice that Edison was drinking in my house and left there. Like, Edison went into Trudy's, well, his, I should say, refrigerator, grabbed the drink, and went into Victoria's house and sat on her couch to drink it. He has a couch in his house. <sighs> Employees, okay. If you put the employees, that means your maids, maids, and anyone who comes to do service in your home can come in. But anyone else needs to be shut out from here. Oh, look how nice it looks. 
a little corner. Why did I put that picture there now? I'm thinking about it. It looks really stupid. Because that, that's for get to work. That's for like um, shopping, for like furniture store. <laughs> for some reason, I have, I have it in there. I don't know what, what I was thinking. Why did I put that in there? I just like I just liked it because it was red, I suppose. Anyway, back in here. Yeah, there's something filthy in her room, someplace. Anyway. Ah, uh, everything's okay. Who's used the toilet? I think I have a sleep. Sleepy, sleepy, go to sleep. Trudy, you can get a bit as well. Well, no, you don't actually. I don't mind. You seem to be okay. Mm. Yes, he's leaving. Okay, see you late, pigling. We didn't get much progress with him on the romantic side, but we got really friendly with him. So, that's important. Friendship is important. Very, very important. So, actually going to end the part here. I'll see you guys next time on that. Everyone's awake. And we'll see the life of Baby and everybody together. Okay, see you next time. Bye!